what's up guys shazad here so lenovo's ybui on k3 note brings some useful features with it so i decided to make a separate video showcasing some of my favorite features and tricks so without any further delay let's jump right into this first of all i got this question a lot that does it have double tap to wake so yes it does have double tap to wake just tap and hold on ceramic speaker toggle or go into the settings and features and turn on knock to light so there you have double tap to wake and there are also some great features like quick snap once you turn this thing on you can take pictures by double tapping either of your volume keys when the screen is turned off Then we have some other screen of gestures like slide to unlock and drawing V for camera and so on. Then we also have smart scene mode uh, which is very cool. It allows you to automate your phone to do certain tasks at a certain time or place something similar to tasker so if i just click this add button so for example i want to make a profile for my home so when i reach back home i want my wi-fi to be turned on brightness to be set to the lowest settings and i want my profile to be general back again so lastly i just have to set the start and end time and now it will change all of these settings every day automatically and it is really useful for me and then we have white touch something similar to assistive touch from ios but with lot more features like you can open up calculator camera and quick toggles and even lock screen and if you just feel that the display of k3 note is too warm or too cold for your liking then you can easily tweak that by going into the settings and display then going into color balance so now you can change the tone to warm or cold and also saturate or desaturate the display. Then in the notification settings, you can go into advanced settings and here you can enable battery percentage and also network speed in notification bar. In the call settings you can turn on smart answer it automatically answers the call when you just raise your device near to your ear and you can also turn on flip to mute as the name implies it mutes your phone's ringtone when you just flip the phone now you all know that you can open up multitasking menu by just pressing the menu key but if you just tap and hold this ram cleaning button it will take you to the running services and it will show you more detailed information about which app is running in the background and also you can see your free RAM store, RAM space, etc. And when you are running out of battery and have no charges around, there are two power saving modes on the K3 Note. One is the ultimate power saving mode. In the ultimate power saving mode, you can only use some essential stuffs, but it increases the battery life and standby time a lot. Then we also have a normal power saving mode which just reduces the screen brightness and turns off haptic feedback so it is also very useful. So guys that's pretty much wraps up for my favorite features of the Vibe UI on K3 Note. So if this video was helpful for you don't forget to hit that like and a subscribe button it really helps the channel a lot. And if you are new here then don't forget to hit that subscribe button because there will be a lot more coverage of this one coming soon. So yeah that's it for this video and I will catch you all in the next one.